make a wish. Count to three. Come with me, and you'll be in a world of pure imagination. Take a look, and you'll. Hey guys, it's Kerry or Wonka, whatever you prefer. Uh, yeah, back again. Uh, no, I'm just playing. Yo, what up, my nerds? It's your boy Wonka, and I'm back like a heart attack. You know I got it like that, and all right. And I don't know, I gotta make up like a flow for my intros, man. I don't know why, I just feel like I do. I just feel like I do, I don't know. But, you know what? I'm starting this new thing on uh, everything, pretty much. New thing on everything. So, if you, I'm talking to you, if you... Our true nerd, Wonka fan, whatever you want to call yourself. You're a nerd. Or you're Oompa Loompa. I'm not going to call you Oompa Loompas no more. Fuck that. That's kind of just weird. If you're, a real, if you're a real nerd, just, I want you guys to start going on other people's videos and just write nerd after the comment. Just like, um, so like, oh, this is a great video, blah, blah, blah. And then put nerd at the end. Just so these niggas know where y'all coming from. Y'all coming from the nerd nation, man. And we going big and we going everywhere. And uh, yeah, but um, I'm playing a little uh, firing range. Yeah, firing range. I don't know. I just start putting, I don't know. I just like saying nerdly for some reason. I don't know. I'm going to just, I feel like I just got to start something. Like start my own little thing and uh, hope it catches on. If it doesn't, then fuck it. But I tried. You get what I'm saying? But uh. Playing a little firing range, got my gold commando and uh, my red dot. Oh, man, 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 oh man, oh man. I haven't actually been playing that much at all lately. Um, I just kind of been doing other stuff. I don't know. Uh, this past weekend was uh, MLG Anaheim, and uh, that's pretty much all I watched. And um, I watched, uh, I actually watched them. Only wa I pretty much watched that the stream, the MLG Anaheim stream, and. Um, the uh, and uh, this movie called The Taurus with uh, Johnny Depp and uh, Angelina Jolie, and I really wasn't I wasn't paying that much attention. I was kind of paying attention, but I really wasn't paying attention. It was like you, whenever your girl talking to you, you just be like, oh yeah, 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 and I'm just cleaning up the kills. They just they just keep coming to you like dumbasses. It doesn't make any sense. But um, I don't know. The Commando would be really, really, really good if it shot as fast as the Famas. Like. I think it has the same power and stuff like that, and the recoil is ridiculous easy to use. But like, if it had the same, if it if it shot out as fast as the Famas did, then uh, I mean the Commando would be unrivaled, honestly. Like, I don't even think like, cause the Famas has that recoil. Well, not so much since they patched it, but like, I don't know. Some people think that is the re recoil is different on the Famas, but I don't know. I think it's just like. It's a little bit easier to use it for us because it doesn't recoil the same. I'll also put it that way. But uh, there is a recoil on there to me. I don't know. But I don't know. I, the Commando's easy as hell to use, man. It's like it's like the perfect gun. It just doesn't shoot out fast enough. And sometimes you'll just get raped. But it's a really good long distance gun. But that's my opinion. But, you know, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. But uh, I actually been uh, going on this, like, gold gun tear. I started playing, like, wager matches and stuff uh, last week. And um, just bought me like three gold guns and shit like that. And um, people take, you think like people take those wager matches serious, bro? Like seriously, like they don't don't nobody want to lose they ten G's, man. Seriously, but uh, it's whatever, man. But uh, I actually been watching the uh, MLG Anaheim stream. Where you going, mobile? Sit down. Uh, I've been watching the ML. I had, why do dudes have booties and and asses and. Dicks and stuff. I don't understand that. How are you not gay and you got a dick on your your <laughs> you got a dick on your emblem? Like I don't get that. How are you not gay? You know, I mean, I mean, there's nothing wrong with being gay. I just think that uh, there's a lot of closet cases on Xbox Live for some reason. They seem to be kids. I don't know. I'm just saying. I don't. I don't get what's going on. But actually, there's some grown men out there with like dicks and shit. I think he just sn he just sniped my dog. Are you serious? Are you serious, bro? But um, yeah. So. I watched the MLD Anaheim stream, and it got me thinking, like, dude, I actually want to, like, now, I don't want to go pro, I want to go pro, but not at, uh, I don't want to do it at Call of Duty, and I don't want to do it at Halo, because, let's face it, like, I don't know, maybe, maybe Halo, if I, I don't know, if I got on a good team, and I practice, like, a lot, I mean, a lot, because I'm not that good at Halo, and, uh, I'm, I'm, if anything, I'm mediocre, and I have, uh, I would say my call-outs are better than my actual skill, so, um, I think that I could actually 
do something like that. I don't know. I just, you know what? You always have these aspirations in your mind that you want to accomplish, and I think that uh, that's one that's one thing I might want to do is uh, try to become an MLG player because you know what? Uh, there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, it's like making some extra money on the side, going out to events, going out to different places. I think that'd be cool. So. I don't know, I'm thinking about doing it at Gears, actually, and I know there's a lot of a lot of good players, a lot of good clans and stuff like that on Gears. I'm actually not too familiar with them, but one of my friends was, uh, he was on, like, the second best team on, like, on the Gears, Gears 1 ladder, when Gears was actually good. He was on the, um, the first, he, I mean, he was, like, he was on the second ranked team. His team placed, I think, third or second at, uh, one of the, like, at, um, when they, they, they used to do, uh, MLG event at, uh, the Meadowlands. And uh, they actually played second and third, and then there was one in Columbus, and they played second again. So they were really fucking good, apparently. And uh, one of my friends was on that team, so I'm thinking about like me and him have already kind of decided that uh, we're gonna um, we're gonna try and try and get good. I told him that I told him to teach me how to play and shit like that. And uh, I know I already know he's gonna be really good at it. He gets on, he hops on gears and just kind of just wrecks face like without like I have to play gears for a while to be able to get good at it and stuff like that. But uh. He can just hop on there and kind of just, you know, he knows what he's doing. He knows the mechanics of the game. I'm not too good on the mechanics of the game, but the good thing about this new Gears that's coming out is the dedicated servers, so I won't get screwed over by lag and all that stuff like I was. I felt like Gears 2 was just, it was just a host fest. Whoever had host won, pretty much. But um, also, I've been thinking about getting a tattoo lately, so I've been putting some real thought into it. I never really wanted to get a tattoo because... People kind of do it for the fads, and I don't like that kind of shit. Like, you know, I kind of just stay away from fads and all, all that stuff I like. But I'm actually really thinking about getting a tattoo. I, um, I really, I, I don't know, but like, if I got one, it would be just text. It wouldn't be um, any kind of pictures or anything like that. There's only like one kind of picture that I would think about getting. And uh, if you ever seen Invisible, there's this uh, character, the one of the characters on there, he's a, uh, I think his name is like some o Oloan or something like that. Um, but he has a, ta he played in the movie with Jennifer Lopez, when Jennifer Lopez had that baby or whatever. But um, yeah, so if I got a tattoo, it would only be text. I need you guys' help, actually. Find me something that uh, says that, um, hold on real quick, hold on. Alright, I'm back, that was like a second. Um, so, pretty much, I want something that like, that has good i don't want to say good versus evil but like something that's good like genuinely good or something and then like on the opposite side something that's evil and if you know something i don't want anything from the quran or the bible or anything like that just keep it if it's an old oriental saying that's cool but like if it's like um i don't know how to say it if it's just if it's something cliche i don't want that either if you have a poem that you've written yourself and i really i may like it you know i might use that you know for my body so this is something that I'm gonna live with for the rest of my life that um, I'm thinking, I'm really thinking about doing. And uh, you know, like actually when I go get the tattoo, I'm only gonna take like one of my friends with me. So I'm not, I don't want any, I don't want the whole world to know I really have a tattoo. I don't even want my parents to know really, but uh, you know, that's what I want to do. Something that says good versus evil. And then I may follow it up with uh, something else. Uh, I'll come up to that later, but uh, if you guys know anything, please leave in the comment section, like leave a link or PM me a link or something like that. Um, I appreciate it. Until next time, it's your boy Wonk, and I'm out. Peace. Hey, Carlos.